guys, it's five o'clock in the morning. Like it's literally five o'clock in the morning. Good morning, guys. Um, it is 5.22 right now. I'm about to head to the airport. I literally am so tired. My wig is not even glued. It is what it is. But I do have my stuff packed. Um, I'm wearing this really cute jacket from Zara. I'm gonna be doing a Zara haul as well. So if I release this video before I do my Zara haul, then um, I'll link the jacket below. But I think I'm gonna release it before. We'll see. So my outfit is super chill. I'm literally just wearing this jacket. It's super warm and cropped. And I'm wearing leggings and just like some slip-ons. And I'm wearing a long sleeve shirt underneath. I know I'm gonna be sweating my ass off when we actually get to um, Tulum, but I just wanna be warm right now because it's literally 35 degrees in um, Maryland. So this is my fit. Super simple, super cute. Alright guys, so I just finished checking into security. It was so quick. It literally took like less than two minutes. And I was surprised because I thought there was gonna be a lot of people here, but there isn't. I'm looking for food because your girl is hungry. Alright guys, so I just got out of and I'm going southwest, so I get to pick my seat and I have an entire road on myself. This is super nice. Um I had pot bellies, I forgot to record that, I apologize. <laughs> So comfortable, we just have to wear a mask the whole time. And I'm okay with that honestly because I have my whole row. So it's pretty chill. And I'll come back to you guys when it gets to great tacos and just take a look super cool I'm really excited guys <laughs> sorry paparazzi <laughs> so we are at Sphere Eek um, it's one of the most popular museums here at Tulum this is super exciting definitely come back here um, it looks like everything was made out of some kind of bamboo I loved the fact that there were these huge windows all over the space and there's these little nooks and crannies that you can kind of sit and enjoy the space and it was also super peaceful um, they did take like a lot of COVID-19 um, precautions they had us check our temperature we had to mask the entire time and they actually don't even allow shoes and I think that's even before COVID but this place was so beautiful and so calming um, we were able to take our pictures. I'm going to insert some right after this clip, but I just really wanted to show you guys the space and it was just so beautiful.
All right, so right now we're right in front of Pablo Escobar's mansion. We're not going there right now, but we're right in front of it. And we're going to some kind of hotel because they have really good food. Is this the mansion? So we're at this, we're at this beach club called Beach Tulum with my girlies. Tulum is that it was essentially a jungle walking up to the beach so you can see on this pathway there are a lot of like little rocks um, and nooks and crannies but what was amazing is that there were actually hotel rooms within the jungle that were a part of Tulum. but once you get to the end of the pathway you see the beach and it's just such a beautiful view um, I just had to come here for lunch <laughs> Just finished eating our food and I just am obsessed with this little box like I don't even want to show the bill honestly it's not even that important but just like the box to put in the bill is just so adorable so creative and Moses hello Hola. <laughs> he's so sweet but okay so we're gonna pay and then we're gonna leave we're gonna go to where are we going back to the house okay look at this view in this little um, tray in the front and then there's a nice menu I'm gonna show you guys the flavors so I'm probably gonna get the banana crunch right here and the one in the back that white one in the back cocoa soap no So I got the Coco Sogno, which is this one. 
and then a banana banana caramel something. I don't remember the name of it, but it's super good. So this is the banana one. Mm. The banana is like they have they kill baby bananas and put that in. Mm -hmm. Baby bananas? I don't know. Like, you know Baby. Like chicken nuggets are like... Mm -hmm. This is the Coco Sogno. Mm. Both of them, 10 out of 10. Whatever. 10 out of 10. So now we're gonna go find some souvenirs. It looks like there's somebody selling ice cream right there. We're just gonna go find some souvenirs. Um, we have to move the car because we're definitely parked illegally. So we're gonna go do that, find some souvenirs, and then maybe go to the beach later. This is so beautiful. <laughs> Mateo's Mexican Grill. Apparently, apparently they have really good tacos, and you guys know we're obsessed with tacos. So I'm hopefully, hopefully they have better ones than the ones that they recommended. It was like and and so and Yeah, that one was not good. It was literally like, it just like was corn tortillas, but also the chicken was not seasoned. I didn't like it. So hopefully this one is really really good, and so we'll see.
So now this is like a separate room that has like a mini bar and then such a beautiful area for photos. Wow. Alright guys, so I just finished getting ready. I'm literally only wearing concealer. Try to get this to focus a little better. I'm literally only wearing concealer underneath my eyes and then also my eyebrows are like now filled in. And then I just decided to do a straight wig. Very simple, very cute. I've been wearing a lot of body wave and like deep curly this whole trip because it's like vacation vibes. But I don't know why I was like, okay, let me just kind of try the straight one. So what do you guys think? Guys, so we're going to this place that we've been coming to for like the past three days. So here is the hidden gem. It's called um, the food that we get is pollo arroz. Here's princess. Delicious. Hola, hola. Hola, this hola. is our favorite person. He has the best food. <laughs> Great food. <laughs> All right, so today we are trying to get on a boat. I don't know if we're actually gonna get on the boat because it's raining, like really hard. But where we're going is about an hour away from where we're staying. So we're just praying that it doesn't like continue to rain when we get over there. But we'll see. I'm super excited. You guys, look at this rain. Bruh. I don't think we're going anywhere. This is really sad. It actually was just getting worse and worse as we continued on the highway. But we were like really hopeful, like, oh, it's gonna be better. But no, keep straight through the, the roundabout. So yeah, sad.
have an option to do zip lining into the water, but I am so scared. I don't want to do that because I feel like I'm going to go too, too deep. But this is super beautiful. I would definitely come back. It's only um, 100 pesos for non-Mexicans to get in. And for Mexicans, it's 80 pesos. This place is beautiful. So we are at Burrito Amor. I'm super excited to try this place. It's been on all over Instagram. Just look at how beautiful the setup is. down the street from where we're staying but for some reason we have not tried it so i'm super excited i got the chicken breast burrito um, with avocado and cheese i'm super excited so i'll let you guys know what i think about it so we got chicken guac guac looks delicious all right this is meat tomato and avocado it's not spicy this one is chipotle, a little bit spicy. Uh -huh. And uh, this one is sour cream with habanero. It is very, very spicy. Very spicy. Okay, thank you. Yeah, Looks yummy. I don't like beans, so I got it on the side. Maybe I'll like it today. Let's see. So for our last day, we wanted to come back to Bitaloom. I absolutely loved this place when we first came. It was just so nice and there's so many cabana beds. We just loved it here so we were like, we have to come back. And I'm just obsessed with the view. I'm going to show you guys in a second but they have the best pina colada over here. And because there's like little um, like coconut chunks in there. So I just want to show you guys my view because this is really crazy. Like the water starts off so like almost clear, then green, then light blue, and you can see like the dark blue all the way up the end. This is really crazy. So there's where they could make the food. And then these are like the little tables. This place is so beautiful. So we are just relaxing here. I'm literally so sad to leave you guys. Alright guys, so tonight, well, today is my last day. It's like around 8.15 a.m. I sound horrible, like I'm super congested. I just need some hot water to kind of like release all of that. But I feel really good. Um, it was an amazing trip. I'm so excited for you guys to, well actually, if you reached this part of the video, then that means you've watched the entire video. And I'm sure that you guys really enjoyed it. If you guys are looking for more vlog videos, more travel videos, just comment that below. And I will be sure to make another one because this was so much fun recording, documenting, and everything. So I guess I'll see you guys next time. Bye.